Hey, what's going on guys? In today's video, I'm gonna show you which GMB extension is better to use for ranking in Google Maps. Is it Plepper or is it Crush? Watch this. All right, guys, what is going on? You cannot do GMB without using one of these tools. In fact, you're going to be very surprised what I say at the end, but you need these tools in order to spy on your competitors. So I'm going to put the link in the description below. And all you do is you see where it says remove from Chrome. That's because I have it. it already installed so it'll say something like add to chrome i'm going to put these links the gmb crush and the gm and the uh plepper extension links i'm going to put them below so you just add them the way to find to see if they're added to your to your extensions is just come to these three dots scroll down to more tools go to extensions and when you scroll down you will see here's crush and now we're going to look for that little plepper that little pleppy plepper where is he where is he pleppy where, here we go okay and there's plepper now what these two tools are going to do let me show you right quick what these tools are going to do let's type in the easy one right lawyers near me okay so you type in lawyers near me you click maps you already have this installed you're just about to start a campaign for your law firm or if you're an agency you have a brand new lawyer and he wants you to rank in the three pack so right away your plepper pops up and these are the categories so if you wanted to rank for lawyer, the category, that, the GMB category you should use is attorney. Because 39% of the people ranking in the Google 3-pack, the businesses ranking in the Google 3-pack, are using attorney. Only 3% are using family law attorney. So if your lawyer wants to rank for, for you know, for lawyer near me, lawyer, those keywords, that's his main keyword. You need to type in um, lawyer near me or lawyer. Let's just see lawyer. Okay, category is the same thing. All right, uh, the, the, the uh, category is attorney, right? The secondary category is, is law firm but I don't want to make it too complicated, all right? The next thing, now remember, this is the Plepper uh, extension, is you want to know how many reviews do I need to get to, well, it looks like the average is 17. However, somebody's got 111. So right away, you have to start collecting reviews for your, for, for the, for your law firm. Right, you need to start collecting Google reviews. So you need to send over the Google link to get reviews. All right, my review link, in fact, is on the bottom. And if you'd like to give me a five-star review, please just uh, go to the description below and just click my link and it'll pop up. Just give me a five-star review if you like this video, if it helps. All right, all right, the next thing is attributes. So in your GMB, there's this place for attributes. So for example, they want to know, are you wheelchair accessible? Um, do you need to wear a mask? You know, um, is it veteran led? Do you have restrooms, right? So you want to see what the top people are using. 16 people, 16 law firms in the, G, in, in, in the GMB rankings here um put that they were wheelchair accessible right you wouldn't know this without this chrome extension another another 76 percent said that 
you needed to make appointments or they were recommended and so on and so forth. I don't have to read the whole thing. You, you guys can get this, right? And then you go over to your business hours. You want to see what the best business hours are. So they're basically nine to five. Now I'm going to 1700 is five o'clock, right? Yep. Uh, wait, I, I listen, I work correction for 20 years. I should know this off the top of my head. Uh, yeah, 1500 hours is three o'clock. 1500 roll call. So 1700 is five o'clock. All right, see, that's how I know it. That's how I know it. All right. Uh, all right, so business hours. So we're looking at nine to five. Here's the thing I would do, 24 hours, especially if you're a lawyer. But any business, 24 hours, because you're checking your email and you're checking your text 24 hours a day. I don't care that the door is locked after five o'clock. If somebody needed to get in touch with you, you would probably answer. It's better for the algorithm. It's better for your ranking. So that's a pro tip right there. Make your hours 24 hours. However, if you've been in business for a very long time and you bought citations, meaning uh, Yelp, uh, 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 the Thomas Blue Book, Blue Book uh, Lo uh, Law Finder, you know, all those directories and you put your hours as nine to five, don't change your Google My Business hours to 24 hours. Just leave it the way it is. All right, because your Google My Business is saying one thing and then all around the web, it's saying something else. Whatever you say in Google My Business has to be true throughout the web. Let that sink in a little bit. If I knew how to play with my voice, I'd make it, I'd say it real slow like that. I see people do that. It drives me crazy. I'm here for, uh, to learn something, not entertainment. All right, so this is Plepper right here, right? So this is a great tool to have. In fact, you could export all this data. Look at this, you just click it and you can export all this data. Isn't that beautiful? You can see what law firms are saying why, doing what, okay? Very good, and that's for every industry. That's not just for law firms. If you're a, a storage company or, or, or a, um, plastic surgeon, whatever you are, it doesn't matter. You'll be able to export it. All right. So now, now it's the other one. Now this is, v, see where it says get results here on the left-hand side? When you download GMB Crush, you will just click that and, and you see they're crushing it right now. And right now they're, they're, they're compiling data, right? And over here, you will be able to see the specific law firms that are using the categories and how many ratings they have, right? So this golden key was, I believe, I think this golden key was a paid listing. Nonetheless, it doesn't matter, right? These are the top, let's say these are the top three. So you'll be able to see their rating, how many reviews, and where they're located. Okay. Then I'm going to show you something else. I could also, if I want to know about this Sentenzo, I could get his their specific. Uh, I could get their specific uh, categories. So, for example, estate planning is their number one category. Elder law is two, and law firm, then attorney, then attorney, right? I could get their place ID. I had mentioned in another video that I used to do a lot with place ID. It didn't do much for, uh, for my ranking. I would build links to it and uh, use this. It's just, and the same thing with the SID. Uh, it's the way that Google recognizes your GMB. So we see the actual GMB, which is located right here, and what Google sees is the SID. So I would play around with the SID and put it in different things. It's, it's not necessary. All right. So what is my verdict? My verdict is download them both. <laughs> Get them both. Get GMB Crush and also... Also, get plepper. Guys, be good to your family. Kiss your wife. Clean up. And we'll see you on Monday. Guys, have a great weekend. Thank you for everything.